Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Ty. And today I'm a, I, I got a, a special treat for you. I know all y'all that are uh, getting up in age and hate to, you know, wash the car and then you gotta dry it and everything else. You have to use like big towels or whatever and it takes forever to dry the car. You still get a little trickle of water somewhere else and then it turns into a water spot. Um, so I, I just hate that and I'm getting too old to be doing all that. So I found a little device that will help out on it. Uh, right here. It's called a touchless car and motorcycle dryer. It's made by a Big Boy. Uh, it's supposed to, let's see here. It has filtered heated air, prevents water spotting. That's what I just talked about, right? It eliminates scratching and streaking, does not remove wax, prevents rust. So it's basically a car dryer. Like almost like a hair dryer. Here's some other uh, specifications on it. Uh, you can read those later if you want. Boom, boom, boom. Um, so I'm going to open this up. This will be an unboxing, and then tomorrow, as a two-part episode, I will see how it is, and, and I and I probably try it, and then uh, compare it with. Um, I was using like a, a leaf blower, but it doesn't get all the water off, so. Let's unbox this with my little Marine Corps handy dandy tool. He got it. And uh, let's see what's in the box. Okay. All right. So what we got here? Let's start with. Let's start with. Oh, it's got a filter, extra filter for you. Few instructor uh, instructions. Touch list right there. Boom. Can you All right. Wrap? Yeah. Hold on. All right. Drop something. Can you pick that up for me? Here you go. So it came with two nozzle hoses. So you got one. Uh, this is very important because this one like spreads the water. You see that one? And then we got the other one that's like uh, more concentrated. The smaller uh, hose right there. And then. With us, that's it for the box. Let's take a look at the device. Yeah. All right. So it's on a bubble wrap wrap that uh, my little six year old loves so much. Shout you out, can pop it. Shout out to the six year olds all around with bubble wrap. There yeah. You go. Bubble wrap. <laughs> all right. Here you go. So, oh wow, it's it's pretty. Got some weight on it. Tell you that much. Um, there you go. Got the settings on it. Let's see. Underneath, I think that's what the filter is. You just take this off and then you can uh, change the filter underneath. You see it? All right. And here you go. You attach the holes right here. Let's just attach one of them for the sake of the video. I'm sure it's something like that. Not bad for not reading the directions. <laughs> I recommend you read directions. I don't read directions, but there you go. And it's got different settings. You got the high. And then you got the low. Mm -hmm. And then you have the, let's see how long the cord is. I know that's probably what you, your next question is. How long is the cord? You're probably going to use a extension cord. I got a extension cord out here. And I will use an extension cord. Let's get this baby off. There you go. So let's see how long it is. to do this and scratch up the car but oh uh, well she's old is it she? uh, it's a green horn there you go not bad for uh just the the cord here so he's hit this up to the stinking cord um this is supposed to heat up too so why don't we go ahead and uh i plug it in and we'll see how loud it is and see if it heats up real fast. So you bear with me. Alright, bear with me. Oh, so, it's pretty loud, huh? Oh wow. So in the middle, 
you turn it off in the middle. I guess I had it on high um, before. So if you want to turn it off, make sure it's right in the middle. Start with it off so it doesn't go all over the place. But yeah, this is pretty powerful. It's pretty loud too. Let's compare this to the... Uh, I got a leaf blower, so I get the leaf blower real quick. I got a leaf blower. Let's see. Uh, Hi, we're this, back. Is, this is pretty loud. Um, but I'm going to compare the... Pretty loud. All right. So let me uh, put that down. Pick that back up. So the difference, I can feel the difference is the leaf floor is more spread out on um, air. Um, but this one right here, especially with this nozzle, is very concentrated. And I kind of feel the heat uh, warming up. So that would pretty that'd be good in the wintertime for y'all that wash your cars in the winter and get hands like mine. I got this weird thing where my hands like freeze up all the time and turn different colors. I think, shout out to Raymond's disease, I think, whatever. But uh, yeah, so we're gonna take a pause and it'll be the next day for me, but uh, we'll see how it works. Bye! Bye, towel around. Watch out my videos. This towel around back, I'm doing a comparison with this uh, iWorks leaf blower to my big boy air blower. So we'll see. I already did, I used the um, squeegee and got some of the water off because I noticed like it's, you have to use like uh, the squeegee. I'll show you the squeegee I use uh, versus just plain nothing. Uh, I use the squeegee. You have to use something like that. So I got to use that to get the water, the high water off. So let's see. <laughs> get everything off of course let's compare it to sorry for the loud noise but... so this definitely big boy definitely does get in and looking crack crannies so I highly recommend you add it to your washing game. This tab and all around and I'm out.